Okay, okay, okay. It's your boy Just Dale with the Wrong Agenda Podcast. Today we're going to be reacting to Venom, The Last Dance from Sony Pictures. This is Venom Part 3. Um, <clears throat> I've seen the two previous films. i watched most Marvel films. So uh, let's check it out. You should probably know that okay. I have a really dark and unpredictable side to me. So good to see um, Tom Hardy on I'm the screen. Giving you a chance, sweetie. He does a lot of great work. Go ahead. All right. Here we go. Get him nice and early. I never, I never hated this Venom design. What? How do you do? It's actually, <laughs> I like this, this is like a comic cover. We are. <laughs> yeah, we are. Yeah, yeah. See, they not backing away from the comedy. Yeah, like I said, um, this the the character the design I, I never hated it I think it's actually pretty good. I always knew it was impossible. A little slimy looking, but uh, overall I, I, I like the design. I'm glad they they're just improving and sticking with it for the most part. Oh, what is this going on? And it's our job to make sure that remains a secret. <clears throat> this looks kind of like a bunch of symbiotes, a separation anxiety type of thing. Okay. They definitely got a bigger scope here. I can see the world travel going on. <laughs> this is crazy. Gets in my house. It has to be the reason they're after us. What? Lord. Okay, this is taking a direction I didn't think. There's an army coming that cannot be beaten. Hmm. As long as that was that we wanted, everything will end. This is this is interesting. Not make it out of this alive, buddy. The time has come. Huh, interesting. I haven't read anything about the film and what is really going on, like who's supposed to be the main villain. How fast do you think you can get that thing to go without killing it? Only one way to find out! And Venom Boy or something. Alright. October, okay. Um... Venom, The Last Dance to Death Do Us Part, October. Uh, yeah, um, the Venom films have been, the first one I really enjoyed, I thought, I didn't think it was going to be as good as it was, I really enjoyed it. The second one, mm, I came up in the Carnage era, so it was very hard to please me there, but it, overall it wasn't a bad film, it was just, you know, we couldn't get the story that we wanted. Or that I wanted. I don't know if anybody else wanted the true Maximum Carnage story, but of course, I still would be down for that. Here, it looks like they're going in a direction that I just haven't seen before. Uh, I've read Venom books off and on. Uh, this is not a story I'm familiar with. I don't know if this is actually a comic book story. Um, I was kind of... I don't know what I was hoping for here for a third Venom movie. If we couldn't get... Um, Spider-Man in the movie, I guess I was kind of hoping maybe they go the, the route of no, but I don't know where everything lies with that. But um, overall, I think Sony has been handling Venom way better than I ever could have expected, having given the right situation. So, you know, the symbiote monster or whatever that's supposed to be from his planet, or I guess, or the invasion thing, I I'm, I'm, I'm interested. I'm interested right now. 
does this trailer make this a definite movie theater view for me? Um, given the history of Venom and my love for the character and the trailer, everything all put into one, this is probably right now I'm leaning towards and it's in October. Yeah, I'm leaning towards this is this is gonna be a movie theater view for me. Unless something comes out that completely turns me off to the movie. This is a this is a movie theater watch for me so far. And and Tom Hardy, like, come on, man. The guy's amazing. So um yeah, that's uh Venom the Last Dance. That's my reaction to it. A little bit of wows, a little bit of pals, and I'm gonna see it now that round. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's been Just Dale with the Wrong Agenda Podcast. Check me out. Check out my other reaction videos, my reviews, and I got some cool stuff coming. Just waiting for my new mic to come in, which should be here maybe in a week or two. But uh, thank you. I'm out.